Hold that fish up for us, sir. So we, we got that guy right first thing in the morning here. Yeah. Trolling, uh, you've got a, a red plug on there, is that right, Bill? Yeah, this is a little red Jordan Chad wrap. Wrap will brand. And uh, we got us a, a female. So when you troll for musky, you got the bonus of catching smallmouth as well as the musky. Yeah. All right. Very nice. All right. First thing in the morning. Get out of it. All right. Go get some more. In this particular lake, red seems to be the color generally the year round. And on a heavy overcast days, though, your fire tigers seem to work very well. But I'm I'm into fishing smaller baits just because uh, my hands don't work so well, and I can't throw those huge baits anymore. Yeah. Now, and we caught that first fish in about 24 feet of water. 24 feet of water, traveling at about uh, two and a half miles an hour. Yeah. And, and uh, just and about 45 feet of line out. Yeah. Behind so the boat. suspended uh, suspended bass. Yeah. The lure I'm using dove about 10 feet deep. Great. All right. Well, let's get some more. All righty. Bill, this is uh, August 4th, and you said earlier this is kind of the dog days of summer for uh, musky fishing. So, just in general, if you go through the course of the year, what's it like for musky fishing? When's hot season? When's not so hot? Normally, the hotter the, the hottest season for us is springtime, uh -huh. because they're dispersed all over the lake. There's not any particular point that they're on. I mean, they're on all of them. And they're easy to catch, because you can use just about anything to attract them. As the, the year goes on, you need to upsize your baits. You really do. Uh -huh. And I'm talking as much as eight, 10 inch baits. The guys that really, really work at it, you know, and hit a lot of water, they'll catch fish year round. But you gotta keep throwing. and. A lot of people can't do that. So summer kind of tapers off. What about fall? Fall's a good time. The we, fish go on feed. The fish again, will just... start feeding. Oh, the last part of this month through September and into early October. But in, in October we start losing our water too. Uh huh. They'll start draining it down for winter, and that's when we just have to quit. Oh yeah. You can't launch your boat anymore. Ah, so winter is kind of uh, out of the question for this lake. If you lived on the lake and had access to some of the smaller pools, it would be ideal. Ah, Because okay. they are there. They will be eating. Yeah. You know, they're number one top predator. And when all the fish go into these smaller pools, they're, they're, they're happy there. Mm -hmm. They survive very well. All right. Good deal. We've uh, been trolling for about an hour and a half, uh, got a few smallmouth bass. We're going to take a, a break here and do some casting. Bill's hooked me up with a, a jointed, what is that, Bill? Uh, that's a Rapala, and it's a R7, I believe. All right. Well, it's a big lure for yeah. a big fish. I've got my bait caster here. We're in kind of a shallow spot, some uh, weed beds that are just below the surface, so this will skim along the top. 
and uh, we'll give this a try until my arm falls off and see how it goes. The muskie is the number one predator. So he's going to find the best place to just rest and wait till the opportunity strikes in front of him. There you go. All right, we'll measure him. Got uh, 32 and a half. 32 and a half, great. Beautiful fish, beautiful go. we're gonna, fish. We're gonna put him back. Got this guy on a circle eight just at the boat. Just at the boat. So we'll let him revive. Beautiful fish, beautiful colors. He'll let us, he'll tell us when he's ready to leave in just a second. There he goes. Not hurt off, it a bit. Off to be caught by another lucky angler. Great to have you with me. Well, it was a great day out there on the water. We managed to get uh, one 33-inch tiger, tiger muskie today. Right. A couple and, bass. Uh, a couple bass first thing in the morning trolling. So, as you guys can see on the video, there's different ways you can fish this lake for muskie, and um, depending on the season, different techniques work better than others, right? So, sometimes the, the earlier the smaller, the later the bigger. Yep. And just just work it. You got you got to wear out a pair of arms. Already lost mine. <laughs> yeah, I think mine is about done too. So we'll hit the water again, and uh, we'll go for the 40-inch class. Oh, you bet. All yeah, right. that's in September. Should be good fishing. All right, let's get back out there then. All right. Thanks, Bill. Thank you. Talk to you guys later. Bye bye.